A piece of the health care reform called the individual mandate requires an individual to have at least some form of minimal health coverage. It also provides credits for low-income families to purchase health coverage and penalties for individuals that do not have health coverage. After being approached by a community advocate, Wendy Poppleton, Director of Benefits, says that the U's Human Resources Department decided that it would be beneficial to hold educational sessions for students to learn more about health coverage. We've partnered with um, Regents Blue Cross Blue Shield and Arches Health Plan to try and provide these educational sessions. Um, and at that session they'll go through the penalties and the how individuals will be required to pay them when they file their taxes for 2015. They'll also go through the credits and how you go about getting the credits and they'll show you how to look online to find the health plans that are available and kind of shop around to find the health plan that's best for you. After open enrollment for the online marketplace begins on November 15th, there will be two benefit fairs to help students register for health coverage. There are two um, benefit fairs on November 17th and December 10th. Both of those will be at the Union Building as well. And we've invited all six of the vendors who provide health plans on the marketplace for the state of Utah to attend. And so we should have people from each of those companies attending that they'll be able to talk to individuals about their plans, help them compare the plans, and help them get enrolled right then at the fair if they want to. To learn more about health insurance and how to avoid paying those fees, make sure you attend the educational session on November 13th at 1 p.m. in the Union Ballrooms. Reporting for Newsbreak, I'm Brittany Strickland.